All right, guys, so man, I am super rusty at a liquid install. So I grabbed the IQ Shield matte screen protector for the Pixel 6 Pro. And I, if you check my channel, man, I was doing these way back in the Galaxy S line a long time ago. And I thought this would be a cakewalk. <laughs> it definitely wasn't. Uh, but I wanted to go ahead and uh, put this video out for you guys. I sped through this portion here, man, because it was it was just garbage. I was all over the place. I, it was falling off. I was taking it on and off. It was crazy. But the end result is really what it's about. So with these liquid protectors, make sure that you kind of keep it wet. You got to make sure it's wet still. Because if you mess up, you can just re-wet it or, you know, make sure it's, it can't be too wet, but it needs to be a little bit wet. So I sped up this portion here because, you know, I, I started to realize, oh, you're rusty at this. Eventually, I did get it seated. I didn't have to lift it and everything. Then I went and got the blow dryer and uh, cleaned it up. And next, you'll see how it actually came out. And I, you normally want to wait about 24 hours before you start doing things with it. But here it is just 10 minutes later. It looks a little dull in some spots because there's still a little bit of water up under there. But um, this is actually pretty clean. It's it's good to go. It's case friendly. It doesn't go all the way around the curve, but it is definitely case friendly. I'll put on a case here in just a second so you can see what I mean. But I'm, I'm using the official Google case when I put it on right here. Uh, but overall, man, it looks good. I'm pretty happy with the way it turned out. Uh, in the next 24 hours, it'll all those little spots will go away and it'll be good to go. All right. Take care.